Hello, welcome. We are on board the Celebrity Edge for a one week's uh, Caribbean cruise through New Year's Eve. And this cruise um, departs from Fort Lauderdale, Port Everglades. And this is my first time here on uh, the ship of this size, which is the Edge class. And I think they only have um, the Apex, the Edge, and the New Beyond that is coming. So. This is definitely something I was looking forward to and I got the veranda cabin which is extremely spacious, much more spacious um, than on the other ships from Celebrity I've been sailing on which used to be the Eclipse, the Solstice and the Millennium and most of it is due to this new concept here for the veranda which is not the traditional veranda anymore, it's um, what they call, I think it's the infinity veranda so you have to you lower the screen, the window here with this panel and then you can use it practically as an extension of the room or a patio or a mix of both and the bed also seems to be a lot larger although um, I might be like misinterpreting that right now because it's um, just situated in another position but yeah let's have a look <clears throat> so this is uh, quite beautiful I mean the edge is still a relatively new ship so I'm not surprised, um, the new colors in here, the light wood and the light colored uh, flooring definitely is like much different compared to what it used to be on the Solstice and the Eclipse, but let's see, uh, even the Millennium um, already had the new colors after the, re the refurbishment, so this is something that we might see on other celebrity ships. Yeah, so here we got the new, it's like a day bed, not so much of a regular sofa anymore, so you got the day bed over here. And um, used to be that there is a little bit larger table, which right now is no longer there. Maybe it's not, it's not possible to move anything, so there is no table attached to the sofa. But that also might be one of the reasons why this room seems to be larger, because one of the larger tables is missing. Here is a nice, um, a nice little application in the room. They have a corral, and it's really beautiful to have something like this in the cabin. That the, makes for a much more luxurious atmosphere so yeah as you see like i'm going all the way in the back so the size of this cabin with the uh, infinity veranda is definitely like one of the prime aspects of this room uh here we got the toad several liberty cruise toad if you want to carry something so plenty of space then here you got the mini bar, and the mini bar um, is chargeable. There are some masks, and we are still dealing with all the stuff. Hand sanitizer, uh, celebrity as of right now, which is December 2021, still a mask free cruise. So you have to provide vaccination and uh, test certificate, and then once on board, you can roam around mask free. Then here you got the little tiny desk which is uh, yeah just with the news of the day and they got the invitation for the uh, captain's club members for the welcome toast and this one is in the morning 10 30 to 11 30. it's definitely not a regular cocktail hour but yeah so the masks are here there we got some power outlets in here 220 and 110 as well as some USB ports which is really good and then the storage space <coughs> you've got the safe deposit box laundry if you want to send some laundry away then plenty of storage if you want to hang shirts jacket and some other stuff there are more here's more closet space down there so I don't really like to unpack everything unless it's really a 10 or 14 day sailing because it's just such a pain to repack it in the end and the bathroom it's also like see you even got like you get a picture here or like a print a large sink bathrobe then they uh, have the lather amenities again and the shower in the round fashion so super spacious with the marble application on the wall so this is their veranda room and the number is 7233 and it's midship so I prefer to be somewhat in the middle 
and it's also super easy to take the elevator up to the restaurant if you are hungry and uh, grab something from the buffet and otherwise you can just roam the ship super easy if you are more in the middle so once again this was a celebrity edge and we'll probably see more of the ship in another video but so far this was a cabin number 7233 midship veranda and this is in december 2021 new year's cruise Port Lauderdale to the Caribbean and from what it looks like right now we're definitely gonna enjoy this trip.